In one remote corner of Chile's Atacama Desert, there are stones that seem impossible. They grow, they shift, they change shape over time. Locals call them growing stones, and even scientists were confused when they first studied them. These strange rocks are called sepiolite concretions, and at first glance they look like ordinary boulders scattered across the driest desert on Earth. But if you return months or years later, the stones appear larger, smoother, or strangely expanded. They look almost alive, but the desert hardly ever rains, the ground is barren, and nothing should be growing here. That's what makes this phenomenon so mysterious. The secret lies in the stone's microscopic structure. Sepia light is a mineral filled with tiny channels that can absorb moisture from the air, even when the desert seems bone dry. When morning fog rolls through the Atacama, the stones quietly pull in water vapor. This causes them to expand slowly, changing their shape a little at a time. Over decades, they appear to grow in size. Early explorers thought the rocks crawled at night because they would find them in slightly different positions after sandstorms. Even today, some shapes look so intentional that people believe they were carved by ancient cultures. But the truth is even stranger. These stones are shaped by time wind salt minerals and the tiniest traces of water in one of the harshest places on the planet. They remind us that even in the driest desert, the earth is always moving, always transforming, always alive in its own silent way.